Hey Tajah House, Mr Hilton here. Um, just at Sakao Village at the moment, I just wanted to talk you through a couple of things. Might in my head. So we've sat down with some of the guys back there that you might be able to see. Um, that myself um, and the students who represent Taja, we basically had a meeting with the village chiefs and talking about how we can help um, this, this school in Sakao and support them. So one of the things we've been talking about is um, not only building a potentially a pre-prep school on the outskirts, which is a huge job and that's not something we can necessarily take on, but it's also helping them with kind of bookshelves, um, supporting that, and also them getting the right kind of books in. Now, often when we think of giving books um, into situations like this, we go, oh yeah, let's just go and grab any random books from home, and that's gonna work. But the thing is, they have to be contextual. So, something like this, not really contextual. The pictures don't really match to the words that's being read. Kids aren't going to get a lot out of that. Other books like this, Surviving Sharks and Other Dangerous Creatures, don't have any of those kind of dangerous creatures on Vanuatu, at least on the land. So again, really, not very contextual. So it's about the books being able to relate to them. Always on, talking about social media, not contextual. So we really need your help. We need to come up with innovative ways of raising money um, and working with Mrs Knight in the junior school library to kind of get the right book. So these guys have got my uh, our mobile numbers now, so that, funnily enough, that's easier to get in touch via mobile than it is via email. So we can kind of stay in touch with them and support them, but that's something that we're going to really work on in the next year, and I really would appreciate if Taja House could step up and we'll support this, because this is something real. This isn't, hey, I'm just giving a few dollars, and it disappears and we never know what happens with the money. This is, we have the potential to really change people's lives. And these are people who you could interact with if you got involved with a Vanuatu trip in year 10, 11 or 12. So I really encourage you to get amongst it, get on board. Thank you.